Hello everyone, Chris Fisher here, and welcome to another part of my Let's Play of Crash Bandicoot 3 Warped. Warped. And this is, it's time for more, it is time for more time trials. This time we're doing Dino Might. We're going to be doing Warp Room 3 and Warp Room 4. And then we're going to do the two Warp Room 6, you know, bonus world, bonus realm Warp Rooms. Um, or levels, should I say, not Warp Rooms. Through. They're not Warp Rooms within Warp Rooms. I mean, that'd be cool. But uh, yeah, first things first, here in Dynamite, yeah, World 3, World 4, look, the relics start to get a little bit more difficult because the levels get longer, right, as you can imagine, like it makes sense, you know, you're running through, you're having to make sure, you know, you don't get hit, uh, and I know there's some really tough ones coming up, like even I mean, even the next one, right, the next one you've got, uh, what is it called, the you know, deep, was it deep trouble, and that is, well, yeah, I'm, I'm in deep trouble when I get to that, so we'll see how we go, but... Yeah, so far, so far, so good. So far, so good. Alright, okay. Got any. Yep, alright, good. Oh, oh, oh. Uh oh. Alright. So I hope someone got fired for that blunder. Me. Me, because I don't have. I can't edit out the blunders. Well, I sort of. I can, but not that. Not when Not when I'm going on like a winning run. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah, no, Dynamite is. We're going to have to come back to Dynamite. I'll talk about that later, but. Um, yeah, it's interesting. We are so... It's, this has gone for so long, but it's finally almost over. And it's crazy to think that, yeah, some of the last levels we're going to be doing... Yeah, we're going to have Bug Light. There we go. Yeah, we're going to be having Bug Light, uh, which is going to be fun. That's actually going to be the real... That's going to be, like, the real reward, you know? Like, the real, like, tough platforming challenge. Um, and then... Yeah, we're going to also have, uh, what was it, was it, Rings of Power, we're going to have, uh, yeah, the, the, the last boss, and I, I think the last boss, like, I don't think it actually is more difficult, if that makes sense. Now, by the way, they, they're being very generous with the, uh oh, waste of time. They're being very, very generous with the, uh, masks in this level, which they should be, because, you know, of all the bits here with, like, the suction, you know, if you want to get, like, a, a if you want to get a platinum time with this, I'm sure you have to pretty much sacrifice your hit. See, look at this. See more. It is. It is. See more. See more. Yeah, it, it's it's brutal. See, look. If there, for example, I probably should have just ran through. And remember to go up here. By the way, not not to the not to the right. Which is uh, was it red was it red gem path? Is it? Yeah. I think it's the red. I think it is the red gem path. Yeah. And then what is it? The I think the path that we. Yeah, I think that's the part that unlocks that. Yeah, they didn't do dynamite, right? I think. Yeah, which is. Yeah, anyway. Um, no, we're actually on. We're, we're on a decent time here. Uh, push through, though. Oh, damn it. Okay, I probably should have. Yeah. So, look, see here, here, right? Just run through. And gold. Yeah. Okay, so this level is a pain. And I had to practice it a bunch because it. Just the timing of everything is. Every, the timing of everything is everything. I know that sounds super generic. It's true though. Trust me when I say that. You have to be so specific. Um, you've got to do like slides, see like that. See how I slid like that. And then, you know, come down here, get a bunch of stuff, boom. Skip a bunch of this, skip as much of the, you know, crawling as you possibly can. Now, I know this is a crash LP, but I just want to say this real quick if anyone's watching. The comments that have been left on the Spyro 4 video, uh, I actually think are probably the, almost the best I've ever had on my channel. Absolutely insane feedback. So, feel for, by the way, keep going to that video, keep keep commenting, leave a like, whatever. I'm going to address them all like in a week or so. We're going to talk about that. So, yeah, awesome. Look, I'll hopefully do a thing about what you want to see for Crash 5, right? I mean, that would be smart. I think that, you know, it's inevitable that we're going to get a Crash 5. When we're going to get Crash 5, that's the real question. I think it's, you know, in this case, literally years away. Now, what do we got here? And, oh, platinum relic. Not on this level. But I can almost guarantee it will not be a platinum relic on this level. But yeah, very happy with that. Happy with platinum. Big plat. Tom Platts, the lifter. Look, look him up. He's huge. I can't. I think he's. I think he's still alive. Yeah, he's the guy's massive. All right. So yeah, I hate these motorbike levels with relics. I think I've decided that that is the absolute truth now. Um, there's there's no there's no dissenting opinion on it. It's just I just don't like them. I'm over them. 
completely over them. And not over the moon, you know. As in, yeah. I will say that visually, visually they're like actually one of the better looking levels in the, in the, like they're some of the better looking levels in the game. I think that the textures of like the, the ground and stuff like that, the way it kind of like, you know, it's like aging, aging asphalt. That's actually, that's a good, uh, it's not like a good like post-punk band name. Aging Asphalt, Avenged Sevenfold Asphalt. Um, all the signs and stuff like that. And it's for that reason <clears throat> that the future levels look really pretty cool too. Excuse me. Look, I always like looking at the signs, yeah. Neocortex, Neocortex again. You know, where's, where's, uh, where's my, uh, you yeah, where's, we need some more pinstripe references. We need some more Komodo brothers, you know, that they, they were left out of this game. It's crazy, you know, it's interesting to think that, like, um, because I think Josh Mansell made, like, a theme for it. Josh Mansell made a Komodo Brothers or Komodo Joe or Mo theme for Crash 1. It, he was never in the game in the end, or, like, I would love to see, like, if actually, like, how far they got in the production of a Komodo Joe boss. That'd be, yeah, kind of awesome. Komodo Dragons, by the way, are absolutely disgusting. And I mean that in, like, a, they're, like, pure evil. There we go, there's a gold... I'm not talking about Gold Rush though. There we go. Triple A R. That's uh, A A A. All right. I, I, I can't say I'm a Triple A guy. Not anymore. They've got some great wrestlers, but CMLL. I think they're going to be better partners to uh, AEW. Just you know, in terms of that. Uh, anyway, um, what are we talking about again? Um, yeah. All right. Let's do that. This is gonna be this. This is a, this should be a no-brainer platinum, but knowing me, I'm gonna mess it up. Ah, oh, yes, that's right. Komodo dragons. Yeah, oh, I've seen some horrific stuff online. Like, and I and by the way, not my choice. I did not choose to do this. I'm mean, like basically waking up at like three in the morning, checking Twitter for some stupid reason. That was my first mistake. And like the first video is like a komodo dragon just like devouring something. I was like, oh my god, no. Nah. No, if, if they if they ever were like not domesticated, but if they ever like just like breed it like bred and just took over, we're fucked. We're we're actually we're actually screwed. It's over. Like they they're more dangerous than monkeys. They're more dangerous. Like like go okay, gorilla. All right, here's one. Here's one to think about. Gorilla versus Komodo dragon. Who would win? And I'm still, I'm talking silverback. I'm talking silverback. I'm talking like I'm talking sexy back. Right, I'm talking Justin Timberlake, JT. Okay, this is gonna be a good one. Actually, you know what? Even though these levels are frustrating, and uh, by the way, we are now into the next warp room. Um, warp room four. I kind of love doing time trials for these. I, I find them fun. Um, challenging, but fun. Like for example, Tomb Raider, right? That's gonna be like, you know, 10, 15 attempts at least, at minimum. But do I, are they still fun? Yeah, they're, they're still just fun. I don't know. I don't know. What? What? Am I crazy? I think. I think. I think I would agree. I think most people would actually agree with it because it's like, especially because comparatively, right, the other ones are just crap. Um, oh, my bad. Uh, you know, comparatively, the ones. Uh, you know, the what are they called? Like, um, uh, you know, the the. the motorbike and the ski and everything like that. It's just like, eh, boring. You know, it's just like, yeah, you've, you know, there's no real way to like speed run them. Except for, I get ugh, there is. You could say there is, especially with the motorbike. It's like, get the right boost. But again, I don't know, nah. I'm talking about platforming. I'm talking about, I'm talking about doing risky jumps. I'm talking about, you know, especially Tomb Raider, right? That's what it's all about. That is what it's all about. All right, we're under a minute here. We've got our, speaking of monkeys before, now these monkeys would not stand a chance. They would not stand a chance, as I would say in South Australia. I usually do, actually, do I say chance? Sometimes I say chance, give me a chance, give me a chance. All right, so as we get another gold, I struggle to get here. I'm sure this won't uh, screw me over in some way in, in another regard at some later point down the line. Definitely not, oh. All right, so yeah, second level here. I like the, the faded sort of skybox. I think that they were, Ensign Trilogy was a little bit lazy with the skyboxes. I would have liked to have seen, like okay, I know you can't do like Spyro skyboxes, but this is, it's okay. It's like, I like the color of it, but not like the whole everything else, you know, like, like 
The color of it's pretty cool, but I, th I wish they kind of went a little bit, I don't know. But I do, uh, yeah, overall, I actually do like the shading and, and look at this, oh, why did I miss that? Why did I miss that Aku Aku? Um, yeah, no, there's like elements that are, of it that are okay, but yeah, I don't know, it's hard to explain. It's just like when I compare it to Crash 4's vision, like visual style, I, I yeah, I think, I know there are a lot of purists out there that really actually do love Crash and Saint Trilogy's graphical style, and they're like, but to me, I feel like they did a good job overall. However, I almost feel like Beanox did it better. Like Beanox kind of refined it down, and 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 it kind of fit the overall aesthetic better. It's like they, I don't, I don't know. Is that is that crazy? What do you, what do you guys think? Actually, leave a comment. Like, what do you prefer? Like graphical style, Beanox's Crash, you know. Um, Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel or Insane Trilogy. You get, now, if the answer is, well, they both look the same, you're kind of right, but that's not what I mean. I'm saying that there are little differences and graphical flares and stuff like that that I feel like just looked better with Insane. Uh, sorry, with that, uh, no, not Insane, with um, Nitro Fuel. Especially some of the bonus tracks as well, like some of the new textures and stuff they did with that. I think it looked really nice. Any, anyway, I'm losing my voice for some. <clears throat> strange reason. Alright. This is a really long level. I hate it. And I'm not a, I'm not a being, I'm not even fun, right? This is this is a full this is a full time job. You know, YouTuber, full time job. Right, full full time job making everyone happy doing these uh, time trials. I, I despise them. Alright. Oh, what did I do that for? What was that? Alright, one uh, one eighteen or something. Alright. Yep. Okay, time for a fun, albeit challenging level. As I yawn through this, it's not even that late. It's actually, actually, it isn't late. It's actually during a during a day. It's like Friday afternoon. Right. Let's go. There we go. Thank you. See, look, see, look at the skybox up there. Not too bad. Like, I don't dislike it. Um, but yeah, I guess the thing is, you know what? Skyboxes aren't very pronounced in Crash because they're not very visible, right? That's the whole thing. They're not actually overly visible um, areas. Like, you know, like for example, there's no need to have really go crazy designing a skybox now when you're only going to see it for look a few seconds, right? There we go. Not even. Not even. That was like basically not even a second, right? Although I guess you could say, oh, you can see it on the walls here. And again, but that again, with the colors there, the colors work, right? It works being this sort of orangey, pinkish kind of, yeah, color. Like it's, it is it is actually really nice, actually. I think that, yeah, they've done a good job. So I'm already, I've already muddled my own position. I've already gone back on my own hardline stance. All right, let's get the timing of all this right. 105. Ooh, yeah, I shouldn't be looking at the uh, skybox here. I should be focusing. There we go. Oh, how did I miss that back there? I don't know. All right, and there we are. 119. All right, Tomb Raider. The makers of Tomb Raider. This is gonna be. A, this is a tough one. Although it is. You know what? I'd be lying if I said it wasn't fun. You know, staying out of the water, you know, all that, trying not to drown. It's brilliant. It's brilliant gameplay. It's really, um, yeah, it's fun. And I don't, I, you know what? I actually don't know how to how to get the platinum. Um, like, what do you have to do in order? What's the intangible thing you've got to do to make the, you know, I guess it's probably just making every jump in like one go, right? So, you know, for example, here, you know, I can get through, right? There's going to be another bit later on that I'm probably more likely to pause at. So I think that that's, that's where it comes in. So like, you know, for example, here, that's fine. Maybe here, that's where things get a little bit more tricky. No, that's again fine, yep. Yeah. Oh, nice. All right, got that. Keep going. Oh, okay. What's going on? Wait a minute. Oh, oh, you can just keep. Wait. So if you're on there, it just, it just stays down. 
Oh, that's brilliant. Okay, okay. That, that, you know what? There we go. That's how you get the platinum. Alright. Make sure I can get across. Oh, yeah. I think I, I think I, I think I didn't time it quite right. There we go. You know what? Still happy with it. Speaking of not being happy, I had a, a, a sapphire relic in this one, but instead we're going to be going after the this one here. It's like basically, yeah, go to your right first and then just follow it through. I, I don't know how to get platinum. Again, it's like one of those ones where I don't know how to get platinum, how to do it any faster than I currently do. I guess maybe maybe get closer to the, the relic and then... Like, sorry, like, the, you know, the, the timer, the clock, and then do it? I don't know, but this, this, this will be good for gold now. Six out of seven. And without further ado, guys, in just a second, just a few short moments, we're going to finally play some new levels. Yay. All right, there you go. 37 seconds. Gold. Well, it's time to go to the secret warp room. Beautifully designed Neo Core systems, and we are going to head on off to Ski Crazed. I'm crazy for you, Ski Crazed. Sky Crazed. Alright, so we have another. Oh, wait, we've got to do the relics as well, don't we? Okay, so we have another. This is the third, but not final, um, ski level. However, it is for us because we already. Um, well, that was lucky. Wait, did I get everything? Okay, yeah, okay, just want to double check. Uh, we already did the last one, the, you know, the one of the bonus levels, but, um, okay, so I'm going to imagine this is going to be really, really difficult, and I'll tell you what's not, I'll tell you what's also going to be difficult, the Relic. So, we'll do that, and then the Relic, and then we've also got Area 51. So, the thing is, I think for me, that makes these bonus levels in the sixth warp room kind of disappointing, is that they're just, they're just extra, like, vehicle levels you know they're not really i mean yeah no literally they are there's not any level that's just a platformer because the f the last one is rings of power right so it just kind of i don't know it kind of feels like very i don't know just like it's just it's not not not, not like an overly satisfying level i mean i think that you know you know Pla crash is known for its platforming i think it would be cool if there was like an actual like a really difficult platformer i guess that's that's why you could say that a future tense um that's actually a um you know you, you could make the argument oh you're kidding you could make the argument that that is actually like the you know the, the real bonus level of this game uh i'm probably <laughs> funnily enough i'm i might do that but i might make it like a separate video later on like you know, in 10 years time when future, you know, future tense is 10 years old or not. Or maybe we'll see. After, I think there's still like, I think it's like something like three parts left after this because of, yeah, I've got to do the, I've got to do the future level. Um, and then I've got to do the, um, was it future? Not, yeah, not future tense, future frenzy, is it? Um, not, yeah, not gone tomorrow. I've already done that one. And then also what's the other hidden level. Oh yeah, the boneyard one. Yeah. Uh, or, or is it a dino might, you know, actually properly do that level. Alright, this is gonna be, this is gonna get it, oh jeez, this is, this is a bit tricky, but, yeah, one thing I do love about this level is the skybox and just the overall lighting of it, it's just very, very nice, like, it's, it's, it's very cartoony, um, in that the colour is, like, not realistic at all, but it, I mean that in a good way. Alright, this is actually kind of a little bit tricky, there we go. Just because just the collision is a bit funny. And the other thing is that they're not giving us any... Oh, you're kidding. No. They're not giving us any... Um, uh, what's it called? Um, oh, God, I'm loving the low on lives too. They're not giving us any Aku Aku masks. So they're they're brutal. You know, these, these bonus levels, are, they're all about that life. Um, okay. But yeah, Area 51. Oh, jeez. Area 51 is another one that's, you know, when I remember, you know, like, when you, when I, it's funny because it's like, it's a level that's like an alien, you know, like, you know, like the, the spaceship, whatever, but yet it's the, you crash into the sign in the other level, was it Road Crash or whatever, um, or, yeah, Road Hog, is it Road Crash? Yeah. And, um, yeah, that's the one that, you know, like, yeah, that doesn't take you to like an alien level. Anyway, all right, let's, let's just... Get this properly. Here we go. There we go. Well, okay. What? Why did I miss it the first time? Is this a missed 
time, doesn't it? Yeah. Anyway. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, see. See, look at that. I barely touched that, and it counted. Um, and just doing the other, was it the other level recently was, uh, you know, like a couple minutes ago. Um, the, you know, it was the Telno Tales. Yeah, that one is a, that one is a tough one. Yes. Oh, that was good. Uh, hoping for no secret hidden gem uh, boxes and stuff like that. Oh, you oh, see that? It's just the direction that Crash went in. Didn't I? Didn't feel like I did that at all until I hit it, and then it's like, oh, okay, yeah, that's because I like slightly drifted. Yeah, it's just it's it's really finicky. Uh, but at the same time, I don't know how you fix up the code. All I know is that I'm just glad they didn't have it in the. Uh, in the future games, like like you know, the 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 one in it's about time. What is it? You know, the jet board. That one's kind of annoying, but mainly just because yeah, there's a few ones that you know become easy to miss. But I don't know. I, I, I kind of enjoyed that one. Um, yeah, I did kind of enjoy the the jet board. All right, okay. So yeah, you've really got to get that straight. Oh jeez. How I wish for safe sets. Whoa. Okay, that was lucky. All right, what have we got here? Uh, don't go too high, I guess. Okay, yeah. How could you get that high? Is that would it be possible? Right. I think we're almost done. Oh god. Okay. Imagine the relic for this. Okay. I'd actually did I? Get, I think I got platinum in the original uh, LP. I actually don't know how I did. I actually don't know how I did. I got to be honest. Right. Get these ones. Get these ones. That's it. Oh. Oh, that's gonna be a trick. That's gonna be that's gonna be tricky. That's gonna be tricky. Wow. Then the relic is gonna be a disaster. I'm just forewarning everyone. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Get that one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, jeez. Uh oh. Yes, that was good. That was that was solid there. See it, but see how it kind of drifted around. All right. Is that the? End of levels over there. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back. I just want to make sure. It... Okay. Oh god, I'm nervous. I'm nervous, Jerry. All right. Let's see. The food here. Oh, look at this. That is BS. I honestly think that that yeah, that is with with how finicky this is. That was cruel. Cruel Ella. The bill. All right. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. Here we go. Yes. Is that it? Hundred out of a hundred. Oh wow. Hundred out of a hundred. Look at that. All right. Done. All right. If I can get through the portal here. There we go. And now we give this a go. Oh god. Okay. So the trick is okay. But again, we're going for gold, right? That's what we're going for. All we need is gold. All we need is gold. So, it, but every every thing counts. Like every box counts. So you do not want to miss them. But at the same time, if you're going to like risk getting hit, like the ones that are like through, you know, like the ones that are like going to be through here. Like there's probably going to be two three air boxes, I'd imagine. Uh, so for example, that one, that one's, you know, see that, that, there, right, probably too slow going all the way around, right? Probably should have got the other one, that was a, that was a mistimed strategy there. But I see the logic of it, right? Okay. Oh man, oh man. Uh oh. Ooh, okay, this is nerve wracking. I'm actually like, I'm like focusing at my screen right now, like I'm like, my head's up to the monitor. All right, come on. Let's do this. If we can get this first go... Were well, you kidding? You're kidding. They did it. They've actually given us the poop a job. The booba job. The I'm in a pickle. The insert many other names for it there. All right. Oh, that was lucky. That was lucky. Okay, maybe you can like... Maybe they actually want you to use this for something relevant. That makes, you know what I'm saying? Alright, probably not that. Probably not that, to be honest. That was probably a complete waste, actually. Alright, let's do this one logically. There we go. That's good, that's good, that's good. 
I actually don't know what the times are. I probably should have actually checked, but... Alright, so look at that. See, look, with these relics, right, these, that, those bits there, they are the difference between pass and fail. You know, that is six full seconds. Okay, oh, look at this. Ah, oh, thank you, Ski Craze. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Yes, double. Double prizes. Thank you, Sid. Alright. Yes. Oh, beautiful. That was good. Wow. Oh, look. <laughs> yes, yeah, that's that's what you meant to use it for, I reckon. That's my that's my feeling, is that you meant to use it for that. You know what? Don't need it. Oh, you're kidding. What the fuck? What the absolute fuck? Piss off. That is bullshit. Oh my god, that is absolute bullshit. That genuinely shits me off. That is because it's like my fault, right? But at the same time, just just warp in. Like, oh, dumb, dumb, dumb. All right. Oh, you know what? Shit. Okay. What, what, what is the actual time there? Because I reckon. Let's find out. Let's see. What is what is the the time? Let's uh, let's see. Display target time. R one. 36, okay, probably would have just missed out. All right, that is infuriating. All right, anyway, let's go to area 51, question mark? Look, as a big believer in UAPs, this level is designed for me. When I say believer, it's more like I think that there's, there's you know, interesting, a lot of interesting things that have come up over the last decade or so about, you know, UAPs and, and you know, Particularly like the protection of, or you know, the kind of hiding of, um, you know, like, like the silencing of people that have, like, you know, seen things, particularly in the military and stuff like that. So I'm like a massive, yeah, like I, I really find that that whole topic super interesting. All right, let's see if we can get there. Can we do both in one? I, I don't actually know because I have not done this in a very long time. Right, there we go. Let's get that one. At the very least, we have to, if we have to do three. Roundups, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. But yeah. Um, I always think, like, the people that are like, oh, you know, with, like, UAPs, is like, oh, yeah, well, you know, do you just want to see what you want to see sort of thing? My response to that is look up the, is it the, I think it's the Nimitz um, incident, which is the the, uh, the one with the, the, I guess it's called, like, the um, Tic Tac. Look that up. Look that up and, and come back with a conclusion that it isn't some kind of extremely unfathomably fast you know anyway anyway I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't go crazy on it all right let's let's at least see if we can get okay we're getting first doing all right question is with the lights right I feel like okay where are the um where are the boxes like I'm looking it's actually really it's almost like there's like no texture on the road because of the, how the lighting works it's like super super bare see? You know, what I'm, you know what I'm seeing? J-Rock. Gotta watch that. I really do need to watch that. What's it called? Um, Trailer Park Boys. I've watched like some episodes with my friend Ben uh, a few years ago when he lived here. He's coming back. He's actually coming back. He's moving back to Adelaide. So, you know, maybe we should just watch Trailer Park Boys together. Alright, let's do this. Uh oh, oh. No, you're kidding. Oh, devastating. And annoying. Alright, let's go back and get that gem, shall we? Alrighty, folks. Is that it? That is it. There we go. Gem, but not, not the, not the win. That's okay. We don't need to get the win. It's not all about the win. All right, relic time. All right, let's go for the relic. And you know what? I'm actually going to go for it with this. We're like, we're like trying to overtake it at the same time, because I think when it comes to gold, you just need to get a pretty good streak of boost and stuff. You're not really these 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 aliens aren't getting in the way, you know. Uh, that's fine. But with platinum, yeah, I think with platinum it's a little bit more a little bit more testy. But yeah, look at that. Oh, look at that. A rare no. Right, so watch this, right? Watch this. We need to try and hold on to this for as long as we can. Oh, you're kidding. You're actually kidding. You're actually kidding. Oh, this is the this last thing with the relics. I this is why I hate them. This is why I hate him. This is this is why Crash 4 LP was never done, by the way. I would actually, like, well, finished, I should say. 
I would actually go insane. And I, and I think you guys know that that's true. Oh, you fuck. Okay, I'm not gonna get it. I don't think I'm gonna get it. This is gonna be a sapphire all the way. You're kidding. Um, yeah, it, it's just I. I couldn't do it. The Crash 4 is just so unfathomably difficult to me that um, yeah, it would it would not it would not end well for my sanity. My mental health would be shot. All right, see, so look at look at this. Oh, you. Jeez, ah, I'm just restarting. Jesus Christ, that is abysmal. Maybe I should have just maybe I should just wait. Probably, you know what? I'll give it one more go. This is why I do like the pre-record of like the other ones. So by the way, just so I can just just have it sorted. But then this is like your yeah, live relic. This is like yeah, I, I am no Wampa Lewis. So I'm not a, I'm not as suave as Wampa Lewis with his. Uh, yeah, I mean he he plays him like I mean he pretty much includes you know he did like a live stream where he's showing off all of the uh, platinums and then he's done like you know like the compilations where he's you know getting them. It's, like, it's incredible. I could not do it. I just could not do it. I tried for the first two worlds and I was like nah. Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's too much. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Oh, you, what the hell is going on? Why am I missing that one? It's because I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get the thing too much. Like the, um, like the boost, like this. I'm trying to hold on to it for too long. Alright, there we go. Okay, make sure we go in the middle here. Yeah. Damn it. Okay, I hate it how that, oh, I don't hate it, but it slows it down. How long is this level? This is like, was it like a two, three minute, two and a half minute level? Two minute level? Okay, see, look at that, look at that. Holding it, holding it, and missing all three. That's just how I imagine it. Yep, and then hit that. Yep, this is gonna be it. This is a sapphire, folks. And if it isn't, I will be immeasurably happy. Yeah, this is actually a long level. Is it the longest of the four? Why did Naughty Dog, you know, it's interesting, it's like, yeah, the, the next game they did after this was Crash Team Racing. They just, like, love vehicles. Just, everyone just loves vehicles. Ratchet and Clank, you know, Insomniac. Yeah. The vehicle loving culture. Alright, this level is actually too long. That's a shoot. Alright. Oh, jeez. Okay. One more of them. Of course, don't hit that. Why would it? Great, 149, this is gonna be an absolute, if this is gold, I'll be more than pleased, but I don't think it is. Too many misses. What, you're kidding, what? Platinum? <laughs> well, folks, we end on a high, we end on a high. I'm no longer as miserable. Wow, that's kind of, that's kind of insane. All right, well, great. Platinum. Here I was thinking I'd never get another platinum again. All right, well, in the next part, we're going to be doing Future Frenzy, maybe some Relics, and some uh, and Dino Might, I believe. I think that's what it'll be. We'll figure it out. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this part, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye and good night. Bye-bang.